All right, guys, today we're gonna take a look at the menu for the Wraith Mini Thermal 2 to 16 by 35. In the regular viewing mode, you have quick access to a few options. First, a long press on the up button will bring up the brightness and contrast settings. A short press on the power button will toggle between brightness and contrast. A short press on the up or down arrow will adjust these settings. A short press on the left button will bring you out of the brightness and contrast settings in the regular viewing mode. Next, you can adjust the digital zoom using the up and down arrows to zoom in and out. And to cycle through your color palettes, do a long press on the left arrow for each color until you find the palette that you want. To access your menu options, you're going to short press the power button. Once inside the menu, just follow the icons on the right side of the screen to access the features. Use the up and down arrows on the unit to cycle through the features. Use the right arrow to access the feature, and use the left arrow to exit the feature. The first two features are brightness and contrast. Press the right arrow to access the feature, and the up and down arrows to adjust the feature. Press the left arrow to back out. This is the same for both brightness and contrast. Next are your reticle settings. Reticle color, reticle style, and zeroing. A short press on the power button will allow you to select the reticle color and style that you want. The Wraith Mini Thermal has five weapon settings. With a short press of the power button, you can access your different weapon profiles and select the gun you will be using for that hunt. One thing that needs to be highlighted is when you put in a new SD card for recording, you need to format the card to ensure proper recording. You'll find the format feature under the settings tab. If you don't format your card, there's a chance your hunt won't be recorded properly. Once you format your card and record a hunt, you'll be able to watch those recordings using the playback feature. If you're in the menu and want to get back to the regular viewing mode, just hit the left arrow once to exit the menu. And that's it for the menu walkthrough. If you have any questions, be sure to contact.